Hey, <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> so it's been a while. <laughs> I mean, my last video I posted about a year ago. And uh, also, don't, don't mind the background. I'm, I'm packing, I'm, I'm moving. So that's why I, everything looks a little plain. Yeah, so my last video was I made it about a year ago. Well, I posted it a year ago. It took me about a year to do it, so. <laughs> and in that video, I was sketching uh, some of my favorite anime characters at the time. <laughs> Not that they aren't, but uh, I was really like watching most of those shows at the same time. And I <laughs> decided to sketch them on my door and post it. After I finished the sketch, I wasn't planning on going any further with it. I just wanted to leave it like that because the amount of time it took just to finish that was basically a year. It, it was the span of a year. It was mostly because I was very, like, I'm very school focused and it wasn't a very big priority. So I just decided, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll just do it whenever I'm motivated. Yeah, um, uh, this is me being uh, very school focused. Definitely school focused. <laughs> After that project was done, everyone immediately was asking me like, when are you gonna color it? I wanna see it colored. You like have asked it or anything? And I was like, no, I'm not. I'm not doing that, thank you. So I didn't do anything. Now, of course, you know, curiosity uh, starts to creep into my mind. And I wanted to know what it would look like. So uh, I used acrylic paint it uh no like it looked really crusty it just it looked like ugh, it looked ugh, it looked horrible i stopped acrylic paint i backed away and i was like i just ruined my whole piece and i never touched again and then i was introduced to posca markers <laughs> what are posca markers these bad boys wow posca Wow, I'm not, I'm not used to cameras at all. Posca markers. It's basically acrylic paint within a uh, marker and it's super fun. Like you get it and then you, when you open the cap, the tip is white and you gotta shake it and then you, you, you click on the freaking thing and then, ah, and then after the paint comes out, it's freaking magic, it's magic. Yeah, so then I bought a pack and those markers ended up being like f five, and then five became 10, and then the 10 became uh, pretty much 25 markers. I mean, this, look at this, look, these are all the colors that I bought. Love that. <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm just packing my stuff. <laughs> So when I got the Poscas and I tested them out and everything, I absolutely loved them. They were like so, so crisp, so beautiful. And I was basically like, what would happen if I tested it out on the door? So basically what I'm trying to say is, because I'm freaking rambling, is that this video is me coloring the door. It only took a year for me to do this. So here are my characters. I also kept these printed copies of them be uh, from when I did the sketches. And uh, it was helpful because then I know what colors to use for these certain characters. Um, also, don't mind the random swatches of paint and marker. It, it was just for like comparison reasons and stuff. So, if I'm going to be honest, I wasn't planning on making a video on this until later on when I started. So, you're going to see me go back and forth a lot in these uh, time-lapse videos. Also, I'm such a little dum-dum, but uh, I decided to film the whole thing vertically again. So, you're welcome for that. My strategy was to use one color at a time, but then I quickly realized that, like, that, that was so fucking stupid. <laughs> Before you guys write in the comments, Oh my god, those are not the right colors, those are not the right shading, or that doesn't look right. I know. Perfect, because I didn't have all the colors anyway, because I had to use some different markers too, which might be a, a little bit easy to spot where I use them 
but you know, it's it is what it is, you know. So I knew it wasn't gonna be perfect, and that's completely fine. Like you could hate it, but I absolutely love how it came out. Even though I'm literally a perfectionist, and I needed the color and the shading and every detailed straight line, which did not come out very straight. But thank God you can't see it in the video most of the time. I knew, I knew it. It, it was it wasn't gonna be perfect, but it was gonna be good enough Anyway, I'm gonna stop talking and uh, I'll let you guys enjoy the video without my annoying voice in the background. Bye